How to use TikTok Creator Studio. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel App Guide. In today's video, I will simply guide you on how you can use the TikTok Creator Studio panel. So make sure to watch the video till the end. Now, unlike Facebook, which they do have a Facebook Manager app, TikTok does not have a separate app to manage its creator insights. So basically, if you have a creator account on TikTok, you have to manage and see all those insights from within the TikTok app itself. So for example, you can see I have the TikTok application installed, right? So once I open the TikTok app, I want to come to my profile page. So if you're actually a creator and you want to view your creator tools and your insights and analytics and so on, it's actually very simple to do that because all you have to do is just tap on the three lines icon from the top right hand side of the screen. Once you tap on the three lines at the bottom, you'll find three options, settings and privacy, QR code or creator tools. And since we are learning to use our creator tools, we have just have to go to the option called creator tools in this case. And once we go to the option called creator tools, you can see all of the insights of our account. At the very top, we have the general settings under which lies analytics, creator portal, and Q&A. So if you want to view your analytics or more about your followers, the people who have reached your account, you can see an overview and you can see a content and you can see followers and you can see last. If you want to filter this data, you can just select last seven days and you can filter it according to last 28 days, last 60 days, or if you want, you can set a custom filter for yourself. At the very top, you have a key metric for which in your case is video views and then you have profile views if there are any types of profile views for your account and there are likes and there are comments this will give you a brief description of what your account is about then you have a video views as to how you can see how much it is actually fluctuating then for your inspiration tiktok is going to recommend you some of the creators that you might want to follow after that if you move on to the next section we have content so you have zero posts or whatever posts you've made in the last seven days you'll see all the trending videos and after that you have a followers you'll see much more insight about your followers in this case such as the total number of followers you have the net followers the followers inside and most active times of your followers and then you have live in this case now keep in mind that you might or may not be eligible for live unless you have over 1000 followers so if you have over 1000 followers you can actually go live now if you come back over here you can see creator portal so basically you have q a section if you want any of the questions to be answered and you can go to the creator portal as such as what you want to learn tiktok is just going to give you a basic guide on how tiktok works and then you have video gifts and you have ad settings and we you have video sound copyright check and this is just a brief overview as to how you can use the TikTok Creator Studio. I'm not going to dive into detail as I did because this video is going to be quite long. If you do want to view more in detail, leave a comment down below because I'll make sure to be getting back to you and create more videos such as these. Hope this video answered your question. If it did help answer your question, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have got any questions though, feel free to leave them down. Thank you very much for watching till the end and see you in the next video.